So you answer the question, what fraction of that square is shaded? And we give this to lots of people, and answers that are common, a lot of people will choose one-fifth because there are five pieces, and one of them is shaded. A lot of people also choose one-quarter or one-fourth because one piece is shaded and four are not, sort of using it like a ratio. But we have to remember that when we compare fractions, the pieces have to be the same size. So with our fraction, with our shape there, we need to divide the shape to make all the pieces the same size. And that helps us see that the answer is 1 8 Because to make them all the same size, we make eight pieces, and then we can see that one is shaded out of eight. A lot of people choose one-fifth because there are five pieces and one is shaded. A lot of people choose one-fourth because there is one shaded and four unshaded. Those people are thinking about the relationship, but they miss big idea number two, that shapes have to be the same size. The answer is one-eighth because there are eight shapes that are the same size as the colored portion. Now let's look at some fractions in everyday life. Yes, the old pizza example again. Kathy has decided to cut this pizza into four slices. And she thinks that they're equal, so she calls them quarters. But look what happens. Okay, pizza's ready. Hey, everybody, grab a quarter. Hey, how this is bigger than mine? I want it. Hey, give it. 